Hey guys, Apple Lee, hope you're all having a fantastic day. And this is going to be a really quick video showing you guys how to do a zero offset calibration of the 4i Precision Power Meter, which you can see on the inside of the crank there. So this is going to be performed on a Garmin Edge 510, but it will be pretty similar for most head units. So all you have to do is make sure that they are connected by waking the cranks up by spinning them. Then you're going to tap into sensors and then the power meter. And you should see calibrate there. So you're going to go ahead and click that. And then what I do is just make sure you're unclipped from the bike, obviously, and then turn them down to 90 degrees to the ground. And then you come back up to the head unit and you can tap calibrate. And then it's going to go ahead and give you a number. Hopefully that will be 10. And if that me if it is 10, that means it's successful. If you get 20, then that means that your bike is moving, so try and hold it steady. 40 or 50 means that you want to try and update the software. 99 or 0 probably means you want to wake up the crank or try and replace the battery. I'll leave a link down below so you can get to those numbers there. But you can see we got 10, so that means it was successful. And you can back out of this and back to your ride page and go ahead for a ride. And you probably want to do this if there's any uh, large variation in temperature. But if it's you know 5 degrees, I'd probably say it's OK. You can also do this from within the app. So all you have to do is go into the 4i Precision app, available for both Android and iOS. And then once it's connected, you can see up here, zero offset. So you just want to go ahead and tap that. And then you can see there, 6 and 12 o'clock, and then press continue. And that should give you the same number. And that will mean it's zero offset calibrated. So if you guys found this video useful, do please give it a like down below. If you have any questions, do post a comment. And if you haven't already subscribed, do click the red button down below or the button on the right there. Thanks for watching, guys, and I'll see you in the next video.